So right now I'm in the middle of transitioning and moving my makeup area. This is where I film and you can see I have my white sheet. Um, all of my makeup is here and it looks like a bomb went off. Um, I've got more makeup here. Normally I just sit on a stool like right in front of this space and I have nothing in front of me and the last time that I filmed I dropped my MAC Marilyn Monroe beauty powder and it busted in a million pieces and we scraped it and saved it and it's like all crushed now and I just got a new one on eBay actually um, for a good price. So anyways, needless to say, I wanted to have a space where I could sit and have something in front of me, you know, I need a vanity or makeup desk. That's what I'm doing, we're building a desk, and so right now I'm just getting all of my makeup and putting it in this box, and it's not going to all fit in this box, so I'm going to have to get another box, but I'm just trying to clean up right now, so um, I can start organizing. And I just ordered three Muji organizers, so... Um, the majority of my makeup is going to go in these organizers and uh, replace these things. So yeah, I'm just documenting this because I've been MIA from YouTube since November. And I just want you all to know that um, my heart's still in it. Uh, I've just been in transition and it's taken me a really long time to get everything together and um, get the stuff for the desk. You know, life gets in the way and so that's what I'm doing. So just gonna start organizing. Hey everyone, so my Muji arrived today and um, it's the morning right now. I'm gonna open it, but I'm a little bit nervous because after watching What Would Lizzie Do's experience and she opened it and her Muji was cracked a little bit. Um, I've spent a lot of money on these Muji, so I'm just a little concerned. I hope that they're not cracked because that would really suck. I'm just going to open it up and we'll see. Okay, so the first Muji is open and this is the two drawer. I got two of the two drawers and one of the five drawers. And this one is in great condition. There's no cracks or anything, so I'm really happy about that. I will show you when I open the others. So I'm opening up my five drawer Muji and I just want to say that I am really impressed with the packaging because it is just so thickly packed. This is going to be the front, okay? So I'll pull this in a little bit more for you. Okay. Okay, I see what you're saying. Want to help think about? Screws. We don't need a vacuum cleaner because Tinkerbell is sucking up all of the wood bits. It's finished. Here's my new desk and here are the legs, I got them from Ikea. They're the Vika Atlas legs. And we got the piece of wood from Lowe's and we had a piece of glass custom made today. So it looks really beautiful. I'm really happy with it. And now I'm gonna start putting my makeup on top. Okay, so now that I have my desk, it's time to start storing my makeup in my new Muji containers. Um, I really like these and they look really, really nice with the desk. So I have this big box of makeup that I need to start putting things away and organizing. And this isn't all of my makeup. It's Some of it is still in the bathroom and I don't know what I'm going to do with that yet. But I'm going to try to put as much as I can into the Muji's. So the Muji's I chose were the two large drawers. So this is two drawers stacked on to each other. And then I have the five drawer. And I didn't think that the Kat Von D foundation was going to fit into the two large drawer. Um, I didn't think the lid would close. And I'm right about that. So if you have the Kat Von D foundation, it doesn't close in the Muji's, just FYI. Okay, I've just finished my first face drawer of the Muji organizer. And I'm really 
happy with this. I may try to reorganize it some more later, but for now, this is my main face drawer. I tried to maximize space as much as I could, but there's just certain things that won't fit, so I just had to do the best I could. But I'm pretty happy with this, and it holds a lot of products, so on to the next drawer. I'm trying to create a theme, so in my first drawer, I have my main foundations and like most used face products and then what I couldn't fit in here I'm going down here and continuing the theme in my second drawer so I've got more foundations, powder and liquid, uh, concealer, my MAC Marilyn Monroe Beauty Powder which is like my favorite product ever, Face Defender by Mally. So yeah I'm just gonna um, go on to my next drawer now. I know I have this little bit of space, but I'm not really sure what to do with that right now. I don't know, I'll figure it out, but I just wanted to show you what I'm doing so far. All right, so this is the third drawer of my self-constructed four drawer unit. And I've dedicated this drawer completely to Mally shadow sticks um, for the most part, but then I ran out of those, so I just started to put some eyeshadow primers and a couple of MAC shadows. Okay, so I decided to fill my fourth and final drawer with mascaras and false eyelashes, and I also have some eyelash glue and some brow gel. For the most part, I have Mally Volumizing Mascara, and then my new favorite is the Maybelline Colossal Cat Eye. And that is my first Muji storage drawer done. Now it's time to fill up my five drawer. Okay, so I decided to fill my first drawer of the five drawer unit with lip products because, well, mainly because it just looks so pretty with all the pinky colors. I just love it. And if you can't tell by now, I'm obsessed with Mally Beauty. Like, this whole drawer is Mally Beauty lip gloss, and I still have more. So I'm probably going to be able to fit another drawer, fill it completely with lip glosses, so... Okay, so this is my second drawer filled again with lip products. So the first two drawers are going to be lip products. I've got some Marilyn Monroe lip glass. I'm trying to focus it. There we go. Marilyn Monroe lip glass from MAC. And I've got some more Mally here. I've got all of these really pretty um, Tarte lip glosses that my sister-in-law gave me for my birthday. Some MAC lipsticks here. Um... Revlon Lip Butters, Bare Minerals, some stuff I got in a My Glam bag, some NYX, Kat Von D, L'Oreal Color Riche. So yeah, um, I really like this. I'm really happy with this whole setup. I am pretty blown away right now because when I bought these Mujis, I didn't think that I was going to be able to fit even half of my makeup collection in it, but this is all that I have left. Just a few single items. Um, I mean, a little more than a few, but honestly, it's nothing. Just a few random items that didn't fit or that I couldn't make work in my Muji, but oh my gosh, everything else is in here. I mean, this is done. Wait, something stuck. Okay, nope, it's good. It's done. Everything is in order. It's in its place. I can just um, put a little box somewhere and fit all of these in a box or something. Um, and then I'll have my brushes on the edge there. This is my makeup collection and I'm so excited that I can fit it all. Now that pretty much everything is in its place, I'm just gonna store all of these random items and put the final touches on my table and then I'll show you guys the finished product. Hey everyone, you are looking at my completed makeup storage. I'm so excited about this. When I bought these Mujis, I didn't think that it was going to hold as much as it did. It pretty much held 95% of my collection, so that's amazing. So, um, just so you remember, the first drawer that opens up is my main face products like foundation and primer. The second drawer opens up to more foundations and more primers and concealer and my MAC Marilyn Monroe Beauty Powder. 
The third drawer opens up, and this is the only thing about this. This drawer is kind of like stuck for some reason, but it's okay, I'll work with it. So this holds all of my shadow sticks, eyeshadow primers, and a few other eyeshadows. And this drawer holds all of my false eyelashes, eyelash glue, and mascaras. The first top two drawers in my Muji five drawer compartment hold all of my lip products. So I've got Mally completely in this first drawer. And then I have a mixture of MAC, Tarte, some more Mally, Revlon, Kat Von D, NYX, etc. The next drawer I've put some palettes. I've got the Lorac Pro. I've got a Mally palette here and I'll just show you inside really quick. It's really pretty. Oops. This is comparable to the Naked palette. That's what Mally created it to be. So I got this and it's more affordable than the Naked palette. More eyeshadows. So this drawer is palettes and then in this drawer, I've got some single eyeshadows, um, I've got a blush here, just some random products. At the top, I've just stored some products that I couldn't fit. I got this container from Michaels and then I put the jewels on myself. This is holding a bunch of eyeliners and then I have my Kat Von D foundation and then I have my Too Faced Brow Envy and some Mally face primers. And then this, oh, I've got a couple of palettes here. And then this box just held everything else that I couldn't fit in my Muji. So I've got smoked palette, eyelash curler, beauty blender, some blush, and more random eye palettes. And then this brush holder I purchased from Etsy. It was customized for me. And this was the best Etsy purchase ever. So this holds all of my brushes. And I just washed my brushes, so they're a little wet right now. Um, I did dry them overnight, but they're still a little bit damp. So that is my completed makeup collection, and I'm so, so excited about this. So I guess the next time that you see me, I will be vlogging behind my new desk. Oh, and I almost forgot that I had this. This is the Sephora Blockbuster for 2012, and Tim got me this for Christmas. I'm running out of battery on my camera, so I can't really show you right now, but I'll show you all in a video really soon. Thank you all so much for watching, and I wish you all a happy new year, and I will see you soon.